briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The District of Columbia Court of Appeals, in a landmark case in 2014, underscored the pivotal role domestic violence plays in cases of unemployment compensation. They argued that if the loss of employment can be attributed to domestic violence as per DC Code Section 51, 131, the claimant may qualify for unemployment benefits. The case involved E.C., who was not granted unemployment benefits after letting her abusive ex-boyfriend into her workplace, leading to her job termination. Undeterred, E.C. appealed this decision and contended that her loss of employment can be attributed significantly to her experience with domestic violence, a point of view that was eventually upheld by the court. E.C., together with Amici Curiae and the District of Columbia Office of the Attorney General, submitted that the administrative law judge erred in denying E.C. benefits on grounds of simple misconduct. They insisted that the phrase, due to domestic violence, should be liberally construed to include any claimant whose job separation was influenced significantly by domestic violence, even if they would otherwise be disqualified. In its ruling, the court affirmed that domestic violence was instrumental in EC's job loss and should be a factor in her quest for unemployment compensation. It also faulted the ALJ for failing to apply the relevant legal provision that substantiates EC's eligibility for unemployment benefits. The court ultimately advised that she should be granted the benefits she sought, emphasizing the indispensable role the unemployment compensation statute plays in assisting survivors of domestic violence. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.